Hello world, this is Dennis, Kilo Delta 9, Lima Victor Romeo, and I want to quick go over my antenna setup. Um, this is for my inverted L. You got the uh, coax here that goes to the uh, common mode choke slash noise suppressor, and that goes into the uh, 9 to 1 Anon. Both are from myantennas.com. And um, uh, let's see here. That's the ground wire that goes to my ground step here. I got 19 ground radials all together. And uh, here's the ground rod, an eight foot ground rod driven about uh, seven feet into the ground. And uh, I got this uh, kind of in an inverted L configuration that goes up into a tree about um, 25 feet. And well, you've seen the diagram, so you don't really need um, to really go over that, but uh, let me show you the latest addition to my setup here. So over here I got this uh, painter pole on the ground holding up the one end of my uh, brand new uh, double bazooka antenna. i am got this kind of a, in an inverted V configuration for uh, Envis Near Vertical Instant Skywave. The, uh, feed point there is about 11 to 12 feet off the ground and then this leg goes out front there to the other finger pole I got in the ground and then this here this is new this is for my uh, VHF UHF antenna it's uh, poles and holders uh, this obviously is the holder and then this is the pole it's a 22 footer and at about 21 feet I got my Diamond um, X30, X30, I can't remember the exact model number, but that's my VHF, UHF antenna. So that's uh, brand new to my antenna setup. And I was just travel front here. Um, don't know if you can see or not, but the wire for my inverted L goes to this uh, uh, 8 to 9 foot painter pole here. And then it goes to that uh, uh, eight to nine foot painter pole out there. So there's over a hundred, uh, over a hundred feet of wire in the air for my inverted L, and uh, it's working out pretty nice. My uh, Kenwood TS five ninety SG can tune it up on eighty through six meters. Uh, can't do one sixty, but eh, I'll take it what I can get. So that's the antenna setup. And then uh, let's just go up here on the porch real quick. I'll show you where the uh, coax goes into the window, just in case you're new to the channel and you haven't seen this in the past. But uh, here's the coax. And then these are the Comet uh, CTC50M. It's a window pass-through. It can handle um, 100 watts on HF. Um, 50 to 60 watts, if I remember correctly, for two meters. Um, this is the double bazooka right here. This is LMR 400. Uh, this is the inverted L. I'm not entirely sure what this is. So I'd have to look it up. And then this is, um, I don't know what type you'd call this. I found it at Goodwill, but uh, uh, it's doing its job. Uh, this is for the, uh, the uh, VHF, UHF antenna. And uh, this is my current antenna setup. I'm hoping to still add a uh, receive antenna, maybe like a loop or something. Or uh, I've been looking at that uh, Compaq antenna. Um, they just had the guy on who invented that on uh, Ham Radio Outlet's uh, YouTube channel, and he was talking about that. So who knows, maybe I'll give one of those a try. But uh, that's my antenna setup. Uh, hope you enjoy the video, 73s, and uh, peace and all that good stuff.